anointing is in the house. Then he Hallelujah. brings the breeze. Touch the breeze. Bring some peace. He's a man. Oh, 
Praise God. Come on, church. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Come on, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. We're standing and the preacher stands. Oh, yes. Praise God. But today I greet God. Praise God who caused us all to be here. Praise God. 2023 Men's Convention. The last Sunday in the fifth month of the year. And we give God praise and honor. I greet Bishop, my Archbishop Leroy Shaw. Praise God, Reverend Mother Perry. Praise God, Pastor Joan Flemings. The woman of the hour. Other pastors, Pastor Brown. Praise God, deacon, elders. Miss ministers. Secretary. I greet you in the mighty name of Jesus. Our soon coming king. I'm happy to be here today. Lifting up the name of Jesus. Because at the name of Jesus, every knee must bow and every tongue must confess that Jesus Christ is Lord. And today as we gathered here, praise God, let us come with a true heart. A heart to worship. A heart to lift up God. Said if I be lifted up from this earth, I will draw all men unto you. My brother, Thank you. 
on you. Because yeah. if you make a doctor put a knife on you, that's it. Why?
Praise the Lord. And to all the remaining pastors uh, in their right places. Praise God. Missionary Hewitt, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Missionary Mighty, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Our Secretary, Secretary Davis, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I thank God so much for them accompanying me here today. Yes. 
I have so much I, I, I have so much to say and I, I'm a bit confused too spiritually because I'm seeing things I shouldn't be seeing hearing stuff I should not be hearing that's good that's good that's good, that's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. so much but I'm very happy to be here oh, yes. at first we we we, there were two churches that we went to so we went already so far my god that there was no invitation given Hallelujah. they did not call me they didn't send me an invitation I, I am not even the type of person for invitation come that's all right but yeah, so I didn't get any invitation. And um, so this is where my confusion is a little bit. Um, so I just know I'm supposed to be there, just like that. And they, they, um, and I know what color to wear. I don't even know how I know that. My God, that is in my phone. But I just got up. Um, we just got up and we. I told the members of the church what we were wearing and where we were going. Hallelujah. And when we got there, it was heaven and earth. Oh, thank you, Jesus. The first one we went it was gold and white. I saw, and we were gold and white. When we got there, the entire church is in gold and white. Amen. And I'm wondering what is going on. <laughs> what is it uh, the second church uh, it was in Kingston. We got there, and I hear blue and white. I told the folks that we were in blue and white. When we got everybody in blue and white. This is the third church. My God. There was no invitation. That's all right. Nobody called me. No. Angel I, 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 uh, to be so clear, I don't have a number for any person in this church. So, and you can you can uh, judge it for yourself. I don't have a number. So there was no one I could call. Uh, I told someone in Philadelphia when she called that the Holy Spirit bid her to call me. My God. This is after me weighing what I should do for here. Mm. And I'm thinking, I don't, I'm not sure. I'm not sure at all. Because mm. next thing you go, mm. you ask, where are you going? Go mm. back, nobody will call you. Mm. I'm just saying. So she called me and she said, what are you waiting on? I'm wondering, what mama? She said, what are you waiting on? You need to go. And this, at this point, I didn't tell her anything. I said, okay, ma'am. She gave me the number of the archbishop. Now she said, call him. I spoke to the archbishop and he was going to another convention at the time. So I said, okay. So in my mind, that was a kind of way for me not to worry come at all. Yes. Yes. You know, don't, don't, don't force it. Maybe, maybe God is saying something else. So I waited it out. So I decided not to call again. So we are going to our church today. Saturday, the phone rang and, and the person said, Hello, and I said, um, I said, Bishop Shaw. And he said, Yes, ma'am. And I said, Oh my God. So now God give me the clearance. Yes. Because yes. I decided not to call. Just wait on the Lord. Yes. yes. I think the team is so profound. Yeah? Just humble. Yes. yes. Just, just wait on God. Yes. 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 The moment he called, I know this was it. Yes. Uh, we called the try to get the bus driver to take a full load here yes. and unfortunately I heard that the bus driver is overseas so we only could get a seven seater for this morning and by the grace of God we are here yes. oh. I didn't come and this is just me being completely honest the Lord didn't give me a pencil, a ruler, a book of flowers, a no. nothing. My God. Just as I am. I told the members I saw everyone in red, black, and white. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Hallelujah. Um, there, there, 
you, um, I get, you know, whenever words like this is spoken, you have some people talk, you know, like, that's not the right color or whatever. Yeah. But you just stay home. Yes. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So we just decide to stay home. And so in my mind coming down, raining very hard, I'm thinking, this is just me thinking, maybe church not keep because of the rain. And you know, when you're going somewhere, you're thinking you're not sure, but you're just going yes, by faith. Going then I'm thinking, what if, I am just saying this, what if I turn up in the color people having their nice pretty color, where am I going with this? <laughs> <laughs> but the Holy Spirit is so sweet. Oh my God. I mean, the oh, is sweet. Yes. Found the area, we saw a lady coming in red and white. I said to the members of the car, look at the lady. <laughs> because I'm thinking, look what we are wearing. My leader said, it's one of us. <laughs> it's the same color. And so sad, we asked her, and she said, that's where I'm going. I don't know, I don't remember what she looked like, but you know. Oh, bless you, sweetheart. So coming in and saw the color, I mean, I got teary eye, honestly, because I'm thinking God is using a little nothing like me. Aye. Because when I saw the colors and the black, I'm thinking, oh my God, God remember me. Yes. Yes. He remember me. Yes. Yes. He wasn't lying, it was God. Yes. It's not a fairy tale. It was God. Oh, hallelujah. It was not pretend. It was God. Oh, yeah. Three churches so far, and the colors are on point. None of the church that I've been to, like I said, no invitation given. I just got up and know when to go, and yes. then we go. So most of the time, they're going to be surprised where they're going. Because they didn't invite us, but the Lord sent us. And so far, all the three churches are old school Revival. Oh, Jesus. Hallelujah. Which is where my heart is. Hallelujah. I was grown old school. Yes. Baptized old school. I was fed and bred old school. I think I'm the oldest person here today. Wow. Awesome. Oh. <laughs> so that was supposed to show I'm not a baby <laughs> got baptized at a very young age as a child by my dad the late Bishop Flemings yes. and this is the way I was grown so if it is if it is not all school I don't know how I'll, I'll, sit, I'll sit and I'll clap but I don't know how to worship hey. But if it is old school, it will move me because I really don't move for years and years and, and yes and, and yes. But coming here, I'm wondering why I can't stay in the chair. Sit down, Joe, and start the movie. Just, just, just don't move, don't move. And then I'm moving and I'm saying, okay, don't move, don't move. Just, just hold it. But I can't help it. I just can't help it. And I thank God for the humbleness of the church 48. It's my first time. Hallelujah. Oh, my baby's here. I'm so glad to see her. Still so cute. I love her. I love her voice. Such a mighty servant. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Cherish her. Yes, yes. Okay. See, young ladies like us, we are old school babies. I mean, we can't help it, what we do. And they are not found anymore in churches. They are dying out. It's just fake. Come on. Pretend. A lot of foolishness. And I don't know what it is because I can't pinpoint what it is because it's not real and, and it's not light and, and it's not bright and, and it don't have no taste. I don't know what it is. Cherish her. Hallelujah. 
her. Cherish her. We are dying out. And we don't want to take what we have gotten from birth. So when we are symboling like she do, she's a symbol. Mm -hmm. And I hope you're not offended because in old school she's a symbol. Yes. Meaning her voice. Yes. She's symbol in And they come. Yes. Cherish her. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The name, the songs, the order of revival. The real clean old school is dying out. Yes. So when we find school and areas, school and yes. areas yes. and church and assemblies like this one here, this one here, this one here, yes. cherish it. Yes. Because it is dying. Because that which we are seeing now is not even a school. It's not. And, um, see, okay, so let me just say this part about me. I'm a little bit straightforward. So, what I just said a while ago, I don't think I need to apologize because it's not a school. It's a room, but it's not a school. And, um, I, I, I don't know if it's a church, maybe it's not all. I don't know what it is. Can't categorize it. Because when you walk in, you know it is so fake and empty like a zip yes. pad. Try. Try. No, no substance. No message. I, I just said it, so bear with me. I'm very straightforward. I can't help it. It's a part of old school. That we just don't water down nothing. So do you take it? So in my pride, because I'm preaching on me today. Yes. See, people is very offended and very thin-skinned. And if you use them to refer to in the audience, I mean, I'll come back. And if you refer to them immediately, they go into a asthma talk. <laughs> Yes. And then I'm coming back and, and between word and them and yes. we're talking about them. And, yes. and back in the days it was good because we wanted to be clean. Yes. So when the word is given, we accept yes. it. Yes. And we humble so much that we take it. Yes. That even back then, if the bishop or the elder yes. or the captain, which we know yes. then, yes. or the leader of the bands that we know because yes. these days are so near that I don't know where it's coming from but we only know captain of the bands and leaders and elders hallelujah but you have to go into dictionary now to find out what their name So what I'll do, I'll preach and myself because I'm not thin skin, I'm old. So because I'm old, I can take it. Because I'm a black woman, I'm good like that. Yes. And a woman here, no people chat you all the while, cuss you all the while, one kill you. Stand up and take it. And just move on. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So even in the revival school, when you act up, we just take it. Yes. Because we know who our redeemer is. Yes. Yes. You only act up when you don't know who got your back. Yes. That's when you act up. You don't never know. Then again, there's nobody having your back. You have your own back. Because yes. number one, you talk so much, the only spirit don't get the chance to talk for you. Mm. Or through you. Mm. Or at you. Because you're always in a war. Yes. Hallelujah. So I preach on myself. So every now and then, if I see where the Holy Spirit is leading me, so I take my eye off and you just call my name. Joan is you, me talking. So you don't be offended. Because this is how the church is these days. 
you can, if you sing a hymn and look at somebody, it's me that's singing it. It's when Doctor what read the hymn about you. But we are so offended. Everything you're so touchy, and so we are scared to preach sin and repentance because you don't want to hear it. You don't want to hear the word repent. That word alone gets you very edgy. From the moment you said repent, you're already in your feelings you now, and the vex fears coming out. Don't oh hold my bread, man. Relax. Listen. Let out the bread and my relax. Because even since you, the Holy Spirit not afraid of you. No, sir. It's when since God afraid of us. My my God. God. So the theme is uh, James 4 <laughs> and the 10th verse. So, hi. In my pride, being hurt extremely bad in the church by church folks. So I'm saying it clearly so you can get it. I was so hurt and disappointed that I said within myself, let's throw in the secret. Let's throw in the towel. Mm -hmm. Let's call this a day. Mm -hmm. Nobody would know my plans because I said it to no one. Yeah, I have no siblings or friends. My dad went home years ago. So I only have the Lord to talk to. So uh, at this point, I, I, I don't know if I was telling God that I, I just decided in my mind. That's it for me. So I decided that that would be my very last day at church. See, let me pause a little bit. See, some of you uh, can take hurt, and no matter what, uh, it doesn't hurt that bad, but there are some hurt. It go to the core. Yes, ma'am. To the core. Yes, especially when you're not guilty. Yes, I took it, I took it, I took it like stripes, like stripes. I was bleeding from every angle. I took it till I couldn't take it anymore. So I said, God, this is it. By then, a friend of mine came from Toronto. And she called me and she said, we are going what on? I think to myself, no way am I going. I'm not telling her because they were forced me, so I just, in my mind, like, no way. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Now, I used to go with my dad to Watown every quarter, so I understand the cleansiness of Watown. Plus, the revealing messages also in Watown. So I think to myself, don't go. Just pray, stubborn, don't go. At this point, uh, she was at my gate with the car and everything. And I'm thinking, okay, let me just, you know, the, 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 the don't care attitude? Mm -hmm. All right, okay, all right, all right. And you're just dragging and just dragging and just dragging. And I got to Watona and it was empty and I was so glad because the crowd <laughs> at me don't work that well and, 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 and people phoning my face don't work that well. Mm -hmm. I'm not really not that type at all. Don't like the phones, the cameras, questioning me. I didn't come for that. I want God. Yeah, I don't know yeah. if you ever reach that stage. All I want is to drop before the presence of God. Yes. Yes. I don't know if you understand what I'm saying. Yes. I didn't want that. I didn't want to hear a voice. I, I just wanted to drop, like reach there when I reach and the area where you have the numbers and you put the bags there. Yes. I feel to just drop right there and there and I don't stop ball and ball. That's yes. how I felt. Yes. Still in my pride. I got there and uh, the ladies were there, the Watonians. And uh, we went to sign off and mom came, which is Mother Billy came and of course she gave me the look and I'm thinking, Right, Jesus, I'm just in trouble now. 
<laughs> she dragged me up properly, and of course I surrendered like a dead fowl. <laughs> and I went into church and she dragged me up again, and I just surrendered again, now like one dead animal. Okay, yes ma'am. And her hands is in my face. I, again, I told nobody what my plan was, I just gave up. And eventually, she, after service, I sat there and I started raising with my God and thing. Because like I said, it was empty, so it was so pleasing to me. Yes. I know some folks like when it's like, um, and then you get to yes. parade yourself, you know, yes. and show, show who you really are. Emotion. And then you get to show the tongues that you have. Yes. And yes. which side of your hip can move quicker than the other. Yes. You know? Yeah, and, 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 and you parade yourself, yeah. and then you parade your colors because you want to say you're the best dresser, yes, yes. and your turban is the bigger one, yeah. and you have to be seen at the front page, yeah. and if they don't see you running there and mash up something so they actually see you. 